to subscribe and click that bell icon to get notified of my latest uploads. Hey guys, and welcome back to the next try, Alpha 18. So last episode I said we're going to wait until day 32's night and day 33's morning to do some trader runs. But then I actually remembered something. We still have a working concrete mixer over here. So I split whatever I had and left my forges. I think it was like a thousand something. Some men still left in my big forge. Split half of that, put that in here, and other half in my bases cement mix over here. Um, unfortunately, these two, I don't, th as far as I know, they don't have working concrete mixes. The one all the way over here might have, and this one, but that's just too, way too far to travel. Uh, it's not worth the time. So while we're here, we're cooking this up. This still has eight minutes something left, and I think the other one at almost the same time, if not already finished. So while we're here, we're going to do the trade. We'll just quickly and see what she has. And then also there's a quest right there. So we can just as well do that quest right now. I actually, I'm curious to go to this town. I, I'm curious whether I should go there or not. There's two quests there. And if I can find a working concrete mixer, guys, that's one, two, three, a nice triangle of concrete mixers. Because at the moment, we need a welding torch. And if this, these three traders don't have one now... We're going to have to make a plan. I want to face the day 35 horde here. Or rather in my base. Not here, the trader. Okay, so there's a forge over there. But do you have a wilding torch? Because you have spotlights. Please, 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 please. You have the concrete mix schematic, but that means nothing. And I already know it anyways. Because you need the wilding torch to make one anyways. Um, SMG turret. I'm not sure if we need turrets. I really don't want to waste my time and effort on turrets. And nope. No welding torch. Okay, so what else do you have for us? Oh, I left my coins. Can you believe it? I left all my coins. I was such in, a, in such a hurry to come use this concrete mixer that I, I left all my coins at the base. So even if I see something awesome over here, I can't really take it right now because I don't have the cash. That might just change after I do this quest, but damn, that's a big mistake. Okay, resources over here. There's no, at least there's no concrete mix. So that's a crisis averted, because we really need that. Stone, we might need to, you know what, I think this one's extra. Because there's our lucky loot to go. So we're going to sell that, that's just 350. Now we're not going to get I'll anything for that. So let's just quickly do a quest. We do still have parts and stuff over here we can sell though. I'm not sure if it's going to come in handy later or not. Um, gun parts box. See, I think these things are, no, no sell price. Oh, they actually do have sell prices. But it's the torches, right? No, the gun parts actually also do have. Nice. But I'm not sure if I should actually try and sell these because later on they might just come in handy. Um, advanced bellows I can sell because I already have quite a few of those. And calipers. The stuff I'm selling now, at least we have a ton of at the base anyways. So there's no real reason for me to keep on or holding on to that. Miscellaneous. Doors I can sell. Uh, hazmat boots. Yeah, I can sell that. Why not? And fences, whoa. Fences fetch almost nothing. Okay, oh, look at all my... Damn, I can get a ton for these. Okay, we're not going to use any of these. That's times 8 scope. We might just need that later. Sword off, we might need... Stuff I know for sure we're not going to need, I'm going to sell. Okay, so most of these I, I, I might just need I, or not. Who knows? But I'm not going to take the chance. Whatever I have on me that I can sell, I'm going to sell. Why not? After we do this uh, quest over here in the town, the concrete mix should be done. We can go back to the base, grab that concrete mix, do some upgrades over there, and then do that last building. And the next episode is going to be solely a military episode. We're going to do the Red Mesa and the Army Bunker across from that. And it's one of the big bunkers. Okay, so we need stone, I said. So how much is it going to get? I'm going to have a ton for these. I'm so lucky that I actually have stuff left over here that I didn't take with. But then again, I should really take everything I have here over to the new base. Because I don't really use this base anymore. Okay, calipers, advanced bellows, 22,000. Okay, that's more than enough. So you're going to buy the stone, uh, glue as well, because you can make duct tape with that, and then repair kits from that. Forged iron is cheap enough. And if that's I'm mistaken, there's actually cloth over here. So we can start making the duct tape while we're looting. Uh, that is under miscellaneous. Yep, there you go. And duct tape. Okay, stack of 6,000. 
Does it actually take 6,000 to do? Because sometimes it leaves you, I think there's a bug with that. Because sometimes I make a stack, or rather I craft a stack, for example, and it unpacks into much more ammo than I would have been able to make if I didn't make a stack. Okay, so we're going to do this quest over here. I'm not sure if we've done this one before or not. Um, we have done one in this town, or had one in this town, but I can't remember if we actually finished that one for the quest or not. But that duct it went way faster than I thought. I forgot that my crafting is actually maxed out. Also, we do still have a few skill points. I should really see if I can invest some of those. And then I need to see if I can fi find some skill notes. Not skill notes, uh, what do you call them? Yeah, yeah, yeah the, the mastery box. I need to find more of those. Okay, so where... Is this exclamation next house? If I can find more martial books, guys, because at the moment I only have labor uh, labor quest martial. Now where is this quest? I'm looking for the exclamation. Yeah, it is. Bumping, hump. I almost said humping, hopping. Okay, so stage three. There might just be zombies in the area, but I'll let them come to me. We need to blaze to this place. See if there's any zombies up here. Nope. We can actually almost reach that. And it would have been so awesome if I can loot one of these and all of a sudden just see a welding torch pop up in my inventory. That would be so damn awesome. Apparently it's in the working stuff boxes, but thus far I've had no real luck with that. Okay, so we're going to pick up all the resources we find as well. Just because we can. And jump. Now, we should be able to jump down here. And now we're going to bump our heads. Oh, but we made it over. Nice. I just hate the fact that the textures are still broken. Okay, iron, fire axe, iron, that, so that's all useless crap. But we should be able to get into the house like this. Okay, just... Oh, I knew it. I was looking for a vulture. <laughs> that's actually why I paused. I paused to see if I see any movement from a vulture, and it went from the left. So there definitely was a vulture, but not in my line of sight. Okay, now I'm jumping too high. Where are you guys? I need to get in here, but I jump too high. Come on. If I do this... Ooh, I still jump super high when I'm crouched. Damn. That was just a crouch jump, and I almost jumped right over the roof. Okay, so there's no more zombies. I think I'm going to... What is this thing? Clear areas. So it's just a clear quest. I need to do this as fast as possible, so we can get as much stuff done as possible. Oh, there's landmines on that side. Wait, what? Oh, we need to go out. Yeah. Keep your eye open for vultures, John. You have a really bad luck when it comes to spotting vultures. And what are you? Just a crappy zombie. We should also also check behind all these paintings because just now there's a safe. And these safes sometimes hold a ton of ammo or might just need to have a gun or a schematic that we need. Okay, there's a zombie outside coming. Oh, I need that, I need that, I need that. Bulls no, come on, where's my pistol? Okay, so I don't know if I actually already killed a stag before, but now I have it in my come on quest line done. Okay. Bullseye and not enough damage. Okay, so we're just closing doors while we're going through places, and also checking all the paintings. I should really keep both guns next to each other. I hate having to scroll this much. You know, let's just do that. Now put all the tools together and all the guns together. That way, if I need to open a painting or look behind a painting, I can just scroll one. Okay, so this leads up. Okay, now I know there's going to be vultures up here. Hello, vulture. Okay, now the zombie spider. Don't jump, don't jump. Whoa, what was that? I wanted to shoot fast enough so he doesn't jump at me. I hate it when they do that. It doesn't really give you much time to work with. I mean, not bad. I mean, my inventory is starting to fill up with some quite nice loot. Although, it's not as good as loot we have, so probably not going to use any of it. And then what's behind? Yeah, let's just use the auger. With a backpack and aloe cream, so we can actually heal ourselves with that. Now, the zombies might just come out of that case. No, there's no case over there. So where are they coming from? This side. Let's do that then. And then we're going to fall down. Hello. Ooh, soldier. The ring though, these soldiers take a long time to go down. That's why I had to put few, <laughs> quite a few shots into that one. Sometimes they go down quite easily for some reason, and then other times, like now, damn, I took a ton of shots. Oh, there's a other whore downstairs or very pesky zombie. 
I can never tell the difference. Sometimes it sounds like a massive horde, and when you go and check, there's only like one zombie outside. Okay, so these landmines are really not speaking to me. How many zombies are downstairs? It really sounds like a ton of zombies. You know what? We can actually make some repair kits to free up some space as well. Let's just do that. We're going to plant that gun right there. Okay, no zombies behind. But there can still be zombies in front, so that's why I'm leaving the turret out. Actually, you're a ton of footsteps. I just need to make sure there's no landmines I'm going to step on. It's going to suck if I clear this place and zombies don't kill me, but landmines do. Okay, shotgun at the ready. Just drop this one right on the table. And no zombies. Okay, I should really not be complaining for no zombies. At least gives me time to quickly loot this place. Or focus a little bit on looting. And every time I go around the corner, I should really be re reloading my turret. Whoa. He didn't even notice a shotgun almost to the face. Oh, he's not dead. Okay, so that's why I didn't notice a shotgun to the face. It's super tough. So a zombie broke through here. I wonder if it's the one that we just killed first. It has to be, right? Okay, so let's see, let's see, let's see. Painting, 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 nothing. Come on, John. You've got to work fast. It's getting late. Okay, so no zombies can come from here. Let's just close that up. Come on, where's your gun safes? Where's your valuables? Did I just see... Yeah, the floorboard looks a little bit different here. But that was such a, fl a flat floorboard, I only saw a little line over there. Usually it's a far more noticeable, a noticeable line. Okay, so rest of this place. Let's see, our shotgun is fully loaded. Close that up. No zom zom. Come on, come on, come on, it's getting late, it's getting late. Oh wow, that was one shot kill. And for once the zombie woke up when I fired a shot. I hate the fact that you can fire a shot and zombies don't move. Oh, now I know we are. You know, drop down mattresses, right? Yep. Sometimes there's a ton of army guys down there, so you need to be really careful of that. Okay, but safe first. Let's just close. Yeah, the door is closed. Let's just quickly check what's in the safe. I'm really not digging the fact that the shotgun does so much damage to the walls. Just look at this. Now zombies can see us through the wall and know exactly where we are. And it's weaker at that point, so they're going to be able to break through to us. Okay, so I just used 10 lockpicks for this. And I just got crap. That is messed up. Okay, now. Am I where I think... If I drop down there, there's only be a, a military tent on the right side. Or there's going to be closed off area. Yep, closed off area. Damn. This one... Uh, the first time I actually found this VRI, it was so hectic. There's a boiler room somewhere down here. And I had to jump on the boiler just to survive. I actually was so surprised that I survived. Because there's zombies everywhere. At least that was in vanilla. And this mod, it's even more... Uh, it's even worse. Okay, so that is empty. Let's just place this turret over here. The nice thing is you can actually place a turret right through the openings. Let's see. Nothing. Nail gun. Oh, come on, we don't need nail guns. We have a ton of nail guns already. Ooh, hello. Wait, what? Okay, now, is he down here or upstairs? It's not going to be funny if he's downstairs with me. How did I piss him off when I didn't even shoot him? Please don't tell me he's down here. Oh, imagine he was behind that and I accidentally shot him. No, he's outside. I hear the grass rustling. Okay, so that's a good thing for us, but now we have to hurry. And when we get outside, he's going to be waiting for us. Although I don't know how I angered him just now. Come on, okay, so that's empty. Empty. We should probably drop our turret. Right there. Let's just close the door for now. Okay, so with the door closed, we can just focus a little bit on looting quickly. Okay, come on. Working stuffs, come on. Please, 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 please. You gotta be kidding me. I've got a ton of crucibles, but no welding torches. It's like there's no welding torches in this world. Okay, so I should probably make some space before we continue. I should have probably actually dumped quite a few of these things on my bike before I entered this place. Because now I'm encumbered, and there's nothing else I want to get rid of at the moment. Okay, let's just do that. Is there going to be a zombie on the left or right? Nope. They might just come to... Oh, it's this place. 
There's definitely going to be a zombie through there. Oh, no, that's a secret loot room. So they're going to come from this left room over here. And if you go up the stairs, you can actually fall through the floor. I wonder if I can actually sneak kill them all. That's if it's not an insanely huge zombie in here. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, I'm actually rather surprised at how quiet it is of here. Probably not have set off that flag just now. But as far as I can see, they can only come from upstairs now. And there's no one thus far. What's this? Ooh, thank you. Should probably keep my shotgun in hand just in case. Come on, with all these chests over here, there should be one welding torch. I don't know if it's my uh, looting luck or... Look, I don't want to put on the lucky looter goggles because I think that only affects the quality, not what you get, as far as I understand it. So it's just a waste to put that on and off and on and off and on and off the whole time. But I'm still not getting any welding torches whether I have it on or off. At least now we're not going to get hungry or whatever. We can technically repair all these or we can scrap them down. Um, it depends on what we need them for when the time arrives. So for now, I'm just going to keep them on me because we, we might need them. Gun bag, almost didn't notice that. Okay, now time to go upstairs. But like I said, the floor can cave in. Oh, no, no, I'm thinking of a different room. Is this where I exit? That was rather anticlimactic. Okay, so where is that adventure now? Let's see if I hit that side. No, that's stone. Okay, that was really anticlimactic. Return to trader, it says. But which trader is the question? Now, will that guy still come for me if he sees me? Okay, let's see. Which trader? Which trader? It's not this one. Okay, it's not. It's one of the ones we want to visit anyways. But I'm first going back to this trader because there is concrete mix cooking up over there. I almost forgot about that. Okay, so, and I also want to see if we can sell a few more things we just got. Um, so I'm going to repair them and sell them at the trader. So that it just frees up a little bit of space as well. Uh, we've killed so many of these deer and stags and stuff. I don't think we need any of them anymore. I think we still need a bear and a chicken. But it's been quite a while since I've seen chicken and bears are extremely rare. And just last episode we killed one of these cows. Okay, so after this I should seriously put my sleeping bag at the other place. It's going to uh, suck if I die all the way over there. And have to run from here back there. So I think I'm going to leave this one down for now. I'm going to make a new one just in case I die in between. It's not going to be funny if I pick up my sleeping bag and then die. Because then you spawn wherever. Okay, so this should be done. Yes, which means the other side's also done. So that's 53 blocks worth because the other side also has exact size, the exact same amount. So I think we're going to repair these and actually scrap them for now. Or not scrap, sell them. Um, because that's going to get us the most money's worth. Magazine extender. I might just put that on my AK. I mean, the more ammo that thing holds, the better. Okay, scope times two. No, thank you. Okay, so the rest of the stuff... Choke point I think I already have on. Um, the rest of the stuff I'm going to keep for now. I might use it later on, might not, who knows. Yeah, it's just a shame that this one didn't have what we're looking for. I really I'll desperately need a welding torch, guys. And at the moment, we haven't seen any factories or anything for working stuff. If we had, I would have made a whole episode. Damn, a whole few episodes just covering that. Okay, so we need to go upwards. It's a shame because there's two quests just right there next to each other. But for the moment, we need to get back. We need to get some building done as well. And then we need to see if the other two traders perhaps have a welding torch. The day one of those have a welding torch, guys, I don't know. I, I should actually make a celebration or something. Because I've been looking. How many in-games now has it, days has it been since I've started looking and I still haven't found one? It's that rare for some reason. See, guys, this is the place I want to do next episode. Red Mesa and the next door, this massive army facility. That's where you go through the bathrooms to get to the secret loot. If I can get all the ammo in there, I should be set for the next whole day. But, like I said, I want to face the horde at this new place. So we basically just need to make steps at the moment. Uh, we almost have blade traps covering the whole facility, the whole base. Which is actually very awesome. But this wall needs to be done and the walkway needs to be done before the horde for us to be able to use this. Otherwise, they're just going to break through the walls. It's not going to be a challenge at all. Because remember, the blade traps are tough when it comes to taking down zombies. But the blade traps themselves aren't that tough. I think they only have like 2.5k health. Yep, this is also done. This is a little bit more than the one I had on me. We actually had a... Where is it now? Nail gun. Yeah, <laughs> we looted a nail gun so I can just quickly use this now. Uh, where are my frames? 
Do I have a ton of frames left though? I can't remember if I actually... No, we do. Yes, nice. Okay, um, I think that's the only ones we have. So we're just going to put that on top of here. So that's going to be the first line like so. And then it's going to have a roof like the other ones. So I first need to do this one first before I can actually get the rest up. And I just need to remember, I need to, I still need blade traps over here. I still need two sides worth of blade traps. And I still need to connect all the blade traps on the other two sides. Remember we did two on camera and I said I'll do the other two off. But I just haven't had the time yet. The only problem with our current defense is the fact that we need a, a new entrance now. This has stopped cooking, but all the stone is in. Nice. Uh, where did I put my wood? Right there, John. Okay, but you need way more than that. Uh, where are our chairs? Only nine left. That sucks. Okay, so let's just put four in each for now. That should be enough to actually cook up the cement, I think. Yeah, three is enough. So one, two, three. No, four. Damn, that sucks. But hey, at least it's getting 329 out of this one. 329 out of this one. Uh, one, two, three, four. And then a way more out of this one, actually, because it has three slots to cook in stone. Wait, I still heard fire going, so it must just be this chemistry station cooking up some gas for me. Okay, so we're going to put this in here. How much is it going to take uh, to get all that cement out? 13 minutes, so I don't have enough wood, I think. Oh, no, we do. Way then more than enough. Okay, so we're going to craft all of that up. We should actually put more stone in there. But I need to first buy more stone before I do that. Or go mine more stone, but who, would, who has time for that, right? Okay, so this is done, but I still had fire. I heard the fire going. That's why I actually came down here quickly to see if the fire was worth still going or not. I just assumed the big one was still going, but it seems but all three of them are out. Oh, hello, where did you come from? It almost looked like spawned out of thin air. I just all of a sudden saw him running, and I just, no, 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 you're not going to destroy my base, sorry. Okay, those ones are headed to your See, I think there's something to do with sound in this game. Kind of, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but did you make it so that if the zombies hear sound, the heat map goes up in incredibly high? Because the zombies, they're drawn by sound. I love that fact, actually. Noise should draw zombies. That's why I get so irritated. See, three of you now. That's why I get so irritated inside of your eyes when you fire a gun right next to a zombie and the thing doesn't move. Okay, and finally out of concrete mix. See, now the base is getting high enough. That's one, two, three, four. We actually need a fifth layer on top of that. Uh, that we should actually start focusing on iron bars. We're definitely going to need that for around the place. Because remember, spider zombies can still jump up. We need to block that. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to have iron bars going straight up too high. So that if the zombies try and jump at me, they're going to hit the iron bars and fall down. I think that's going to be the best course of action for now. And now... I should really need to reorder these workbenches. Okay, that's 29, 28, that's 14 blocks worth. That's not really much. I just wonder why this doesn't shift click. If you shift click stuff into your inventory, it goes yeah, not onto the belt. You need to go out of the inventory into yeah. Okay, so let's just quickly do some inventory sorting. I love the fact that you can just go bam, bam, and it already starts clearing up. You can actually see how the stuff disappears out of your inventory. Okay, so I just noticed we have way too little shotgun ammo left. And that's our main contributor to zombie kills. So we need to buy more ammo as well when we're at the trader now. It's a good thing I not just noticed that. Damn, that could have cost us. Okay, so we're going to do this. You should actually probably get rid of all the clutter that's not in the inventory. Whoa, hello. No, 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 no. Don't, sh don't hit my base. Don't hit my base. I just, I just hit my base. Okay, I hate that. <laughs> this gun is so powerful, I destroyed my own base. Okay, so what was I busy with? Oh, I was busy putting stuff away over here. Oh, for a moment I thought there was another zombie, but it's just everything falling down. Okay, so this we're going to drop right here. I hope there's actually some concrete mix at the base as well. That's going to come in handy. I mean, if we can buy some while we're making some, that's going to be epic. Okay, now unfortunately it seems our inventory is still a little bit cluttered. Meat stew, nope, we don't really need anything right now. And this fire, because they have everything, it, yeah, it has everything it needs. So by the time I get back here, I'll be able to put way more into the concrete mixer. But I'm actually thinking of putting half here again, half at the other place. It's just way easier getting stuff done together. Okay, so grab everything you want to sell. We do still have the repair kits on me, I think. Now, did I drop them? I can't believe I already had repair kits in here. Or did I put them on my bike? I had 23 lock, uh, lock, not lockpicks. 
Where did I? Oh, it's in the gun box. I forgot that I already made some. Um, the repair kits. There were repair kits in here. That's why when I clicked, it all went in here. I forgot that I made a ton already. I keep forgetting that I do stuff. I hate that. I think I, that's why I'm turning 29 this year, guys. But I feel so damn old. Because I forget the most basic of things sometimes. Hello. Oh. Oh, for a moment I thought that bush next to us was another zombie. Like a wandering horde passing through. Okay, so there's nothing on the bike, right? Just want to make sure of that fact. Yep, okay, the rest of the stuff we can go sell. Now, hopefully, the, these traders have what we want. I mean, we already have to hand in a quest over there, so please be more. So, I think first, we still need to clear these two houses. We're going to do that, and then we're going to check out the traders. I seriously can't remember when, whether we've done this place before or not. I know we killed the zombie that was in there, but there's a new one over there. This we've looted. I really think we've done this place before, but let's just do it again. If the loot is empty, I'm not going to do it again, obviously. Okay, there you are. I thought there must be a zombie somewhere. What's that? Wait, is there a zombie upstairs? What was that noise just now? Something massive just broke. Okay, so you can get a ton of parts out of this when you scrap it, I think. Or not scrap it, when you wrench it. I don't have my wrench on me, so I can't really test that right now. See, that's empty. That's untouched. So I only half looted this place. I think I went for the secret loot in the roof. So the roof is already cleared. There's a zombie up here as well. And the secret stash. Yeah, I already got that. Let's just get the concrete mix while we're here anyways. But that's all been looted. The box is op broken open and everything. Remember, we, spawn, uh, we play with loot respawn off, so it's not going to be refilled. That just means we have one less place to f uh, focus on. That means we have one house left. This one. And then we can do the military facilities next episode. Nice. Or no, the Red Mesa is there. So we still have unexplored terrain there, but I'm first going to do the, this over here since we already discovered that. But that's going to be next episode. So next episode, we're going to do a ton of zombie killing. Because those places are crawling with zombies. But for now, let's just see. Do I need to put a few things away? Let's do it. Stuff we're going to sell and all my tokens are going to go on my bike. Just because we need the space. I always complain when I'm inside that I didn't put stuff away. So now that I'm outside, let's just do this. Okay, so that we don't really need. That we put away. But then again, that can stack if there's more resources in there. So we just do this. And voila. Okay, so we just need to remember when we're at the traders to buy more shotgun ammo. Especially since this is our main weapon. Okay, no zombies there. Did I do this place as well? It kind of looks familiar. Please tell me I didn't. Okay, I didn't. Nice. I want to place loot. That's why I say please tell me I didn't. Garage box. Nice. Thank you. And not what we need. Damn it. Hello. Where are you guys? How did they hear me all the way from a, ce a cemetery, but some zombies can't hear a gunshot right next to them? That's messed up. Ooh, toolbox. Damn, come on. I need it. I need it. We're going to do this. Place this right there. So we can focus a little bit on opening this chest or this crate. Please, man. Please. I'm getting desperate. Okay, um, the toolbox, I don't think you're going to get a welding torch if you wrench it. I wanted to test that, actually. Okay, I should just close all the doors behind me as I go through this place. Hello. Let's just close these doors because, like I said, I don't want more zombies from outside surprising. Oh, there you go. Surprising us the whole time. Okay, there's going to be loot behind this. But do I really want to take my hand off the gun? Okay, so. Pistol at ready. Shotgun at ready. Turret at ready. Let's go. I actually want to try my hand at speed lootings. Like, just the looting part, I go faster. But I have that bad habit of talking with you guys while I loot. So I can't really cut a ton of stuff out. Okay, come on, let's go. Okay, so we can actually go up from there. Not from here, so this is the only path to follow. But, let's have this gun trained over there. And we shoot over here. Okay, it seems we're going to go upstairs. Ooh. Wait, what? Look, okay, there's a downstairs as well. I need to remember that. Hello. You don't want to wake up, so I sh Ooh. Ooh. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's happening? Okay, so it would have come up over there. I just kind of noticed the uh, sound of uh, boards breaking. I didn't actually feel any unevenness. 
That was way too close for comfort. If I fall down there at night, they're going to be a little bit faster and a little bit less un unforgiving. Or rather, more unforgiving. A little less forgiving. I know you guys said that it doesn't really matter if I make speech mistakes like that, but it really bothers me. I'm a little bit of a perfectionist. Okay, so let's see if we go down. It was this closet over here, right? Let's just take the turret with us. There might just be some guns and stuff down here that we need. Oh, hello. Where did you come from? I didn't even notice if she was there or not. I just heard footsteps all of a sudden, so I knew I had to fire. Okay, there's no zombies over here. Are there going to be any zombies down here? In the water? Crouch, nothing. Okay, so all we would have gotten is this. Medical pile, that's crappy. I really thought there would be more of a challenge down here. Wait, that's nitrate, that's... It's been a while since I've actually seen this, I've seen the stalagmites. Come on, let's go up. Okay, so we need to go upstairs. This gun is reloaded. This is not reloaded. Whoa. Okay, so, 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 so. Hello. Let's just get the shotgun at the ready. Whoa, it sounds like all hell just broke loose. Bullseye. Oh, it just had to be one of these guys. Damn. Oh, there's something behind the stairs of here. Wait, what? Oh, they're breaking down. Hello. Okay, they just made a hole. I need to be careful of that. Hello. Oh, you guys feral. All of you are feral. I think because they spawn at night, they're all feral. Oh, wait. We're just back where we started. So I, I thought he, oh, he dropped loot, the soldier, but I couldn't see it. He actually fell back. Okay, let's just see. Where do we need to be? I might have just destroyed stuff, so I should really be careful of that. And do this. There's a ton of paintings, but almost never any real loot behind it. Okay, so we need to go that direction. So let's just first clear out these directions. So this is a boarded up toilet. They saw the zombie in there, they boarded it up, and then they allow you to go for the zombie. Hello, come right for me, please. Whoa. She's way faster than I thought because I shot right at her and only got the shoulder. So where do I need to go then? Because this light tells me that room, but that room tells a different story. Okay, there has to be a secret stash, so I think I'm just going to follow this. Let's see if it leads anywhere. Yep, it leads up. Okay, what's this? Nothing. Let's go. Okay, do I see any zombies? Do I hear any zombies? I'm just going to place this right here. That's going to have our back on that side. And let's run back. Let's run this time. Hello. It only has our back on that side, though. That's on this side. Feral. All of them are feral because they spawn during the night. Ooh, hello. Bullseye. Man, these guys can be tough. So it's a nice thing that I could actually sneak attack him like this. Okay, so. Work his stuff. Please. Please. Nope. Okay, shark and Messiah is not going to have what we're looking for. But at least there's more gun parts. Although we still need the lathe to make the gun parts. Man, guys. The grind in this thing. I'm not even sure if you can call it a grind. Just the fact that you need so many things to make things, but you can't get those things. We need a lathe to make gun parts. Uh, well, we're getting a ton of gun parts. We need a lathe to make the guns. We can't find a lathe. We need the welding torch to make a ton of stuff. We can't find the welding torch. It's like you can't make anything because you can't find anything. Okay, so we're just going to break out of here, I think. It's going to be a little bit faster than going through the whole place again. And I quickly need to go check out the traders. So now we know this town is cleared. Or this house, at least. Wait, is that a... Yeah, that's a survivor. I'm not going to mess with them, because sometimes they get aggroed by the smallest of things. Whoa. Reload, please. Okay, so we're going to go up to this trader, and then the other one. And then, I think at the last trade, I'll call it an episode. So we'll see, if the, we'll see together if there's anything up here. But where's the red mark now? Can't see on the map. Wait, what? Okay, I need to go back and up. This direction, okay. But yeah, I'm going to call it the episode there. In the next episode, we're going to do the red mesa. And we're going to do the army facility. So hopefully these traders have what we're looking for. If not, hopefully we get lucky at one of those. Although I doubt it, because it needs to be a working stuff crate. So at least when we're done with this town, we can move on to a new one considering looting. And hopefully you find other like a working stuff's 
uh, factory or we find just the massive working stuffs. Just something with a ton of those things so we can actually get stuff done. Look, on the one hand, I actually appreciate the fact that it's so hard to get stuff done. I mean, uh, Darkest Falls is actually now a multiplayer thing. One guy should focus on killing zombies, one guy on building, one guy on looting. Uh, that way you know you get the best out of everything. So at the moment, you need, to, you need to spend skill points that you want for something else on stuff like that. For example, I thought, well, it's also ignorance. Is I thought, let me just check if this, work, uh, this cement mixer is working. Yep. I think I thought, okay, let's just buy the cement skill and then we can make cement. Nope, you need the welding torch. Okay, let's go for the labor cross. Uh, that should allow us. Nope, you need the welding torch. Okay, so, may I see inventory? Let's just quickly sell. Oh, the ton of stuff I want to sell is still on the bike, isn't it? So let's just sell what we have on us. Although I don't think he's going to take most of the stuff. And this. Okay, I'm just going to sort that out. Now, let's see. Please, please have what we want. Five bomb schematic here. Yeah, we're going to buy that one. We might just be able to use that later. Electrical parts, uh, instead of going mining for them, you know what, let's just no, quickly go the to the bike. We need to get out. all the stuff that we want to sell as well. Because if we can get all the electrical parts, we don't have to go wrenching for them. Okay, so we're going to grab all of that. Thank you. Ooh, look at the baggie they just dropped. Sometimes when I pass bags like that, I don't even loot them. Because the zombies dropped them. It was either survivors that killed them or like bears or something. And I didn't earn that kill. So I don't loot the bags. Okay, may I see your inventory? Um, I'm going to sell all the stuff you have. I should have probably start with the better quality stuff. See, now, she, now he doesn't want the green one. Okay, and that's it for stuff we want to sell. This we want to read. I want to make sure that I don't accidentally sell that again. Then it gets more expensive to buy the next time. Okay, so, pie bomb, nope. We already saw that. Electrical parts, we're going to grab all of those. That's just 2 point something K. Uh, fish tacos, we don't need... Oh, we don't need... No, that's schematic. It might just be better for our health, so let's just take that for in case. See, I'm getting a ton of crucibles, nail guns, and anvils, but I'm not getting any welding torches, which leads me to believe that my game is bugged. There's no welding torches. I don't know if I don't even know how to check the XMLs to see if it's broken or not. Unfortunately, I'm not that IT intense. <laughs> I actually I did the um, information software systems development course, but they screwed me over. The stuff they taught us was so outdated and old. It's of no use. Okay, we're going to buy that. Wood we don't need. Iron. We're going to need to start, start smelting iron soon, but I'm not going to take that for now. Okay, the more duct tape, the more repair kits we have. We ha we now have a ton of repair kits, right? Like, too much. But you never know. Some uh, Someday, we could actually almost have nothing left. Because the more stuff you get from the hordes, the more you need to repair, the more you run out. I mean, it's common sense, right? Okay, shotgun... I actually want to try the explosive crossbow bolts we got from the last hall. Don't let the door hit okay, you on the way out. Okay, and then last one over there. Okay, so since he didn't give me the quest and it's this trader, it means the guard gave me the quest. So let's just quickly hand in this quest over here. Imagine getting a walling torch from one of the guards. Here that would be so Lord. awesome. I but nope, you. ammo. Ooh. Look at this pistol. Finally something we can use. And then... Nope, just a wrench. Are you kidding me? Okay, let's just make sure we know all the schematics. We don't know that one yet, so we're going to buy that one. And I want to buy, get that one. Wrench. Why not? Or recog. But then again, the, the side effects of that thing is insane. Any jobs south? Yes. Can you help me with my okay, brilliant. so one more trader, and then we call it an episode. Guys, I know some of my episodes are super long, and I do apologize, but I think if I make them any shorter, you'll actually be missing a ton of content. I don't, I don't feel like I'm getting enough done sometimes with just 30 minutes of gameplay. I just wish we had a motorcycle. I think if we had a motorcycle, I could do all these quests every episode. <laughs> it would be actually intense and entertaining. Because remember, the higher, the more quests you do, the higher the um, level gets. The higher level, the more zombies and the more intense it gets. Come on, please have that welding torch. These traders always have everything except the stuff I need. It's page two. Not seeing a welding torch. I really need to scroll through this so slowly to make sure I don't miss it. Nope. Okay, so yet another horde we might just miss. Damn it, man. I want to face... Let's, uh, let's just see. Um, I might be speaking too soon because like I said, off camera I can also go... Ooh, I can actually read that. Um, off camera I can also go and keep splitting up the rewards between the... Or the, the concrete mix between the two concrete mixes. 
But going back and forth like that takes time. That's why I want the actual torch so we can make ourselves some. Even if we, uh, if there was a bench in game that had the torch fixed in it, that you could actually use, even if you could, you couldn't get the torch out, so you can just make all your workbenches there. That would be awesome. Okay, forge, nothing else. I should probably also going, be going for the loot drops because apparently you, you, there's also a small chance of you getting the welding torch in there. And at the moment, a small chance uh, is better than no chance. Okay, so we're going to buy that. The pistol, I might just use. And then again, I have a purple one. I, I want to check which one's better. Okay, forge, duct tape. There's no point in wasting any more cash. You can perhaps get the sand. There's nothing else, right? Unfortunately, there's nothing else. Okay, so we're getting more shotgun shells since we're here. And, ooh, it's been a while since I've actually checked the guns. I need to see if uh, one of the traders perhaps have like an awesome AK that I can use. Much obliged, so at the moment, stranger. I have a really crappy AK and the hordes are getting just way more intense. So I can do that, but we still need the lathe to make them. So yeah, if you guys liked this episode, please leave a like and share with your friends. Any comments or tips or feedback? Did I miss anything? Is there another way to get the... Wilding Torch, any at all. Guys, I'm desperate. I'll do anything. Let me down, down below. Um, next episode, I will be doing the army camps. And if you guys are new to this channel, please remember to hit the subscribe button for more of this content. See you guys next time.